leveling is a part of surveying surveying means determining the position in horizontal plane is surveying determining relative heights or depths is called leveling in this video we can see how to do the leveling in railway track for top tracking purpose the basic requirements are tripod auto level and leveling staff for the basic informations already video uploaded in our channel that video link is given in the description once we setting the auto level in tripod the horizontal and vertical level is adjusted by using foot screws the reading in the leveling staff is noted with the coincidence of cross hair in the auto level the surface of the railway track should be perfect level there should not be any sag or summit for curved track inner rail is called reference rail so leveling is taken on the inner rail for every 10 meter signage the readings are taken it is possible to take 10 readings on each side the first reading is called back side and final reading is called fore side other readings are intermediate sides we can take readings up to 4 meters by using this leveling stuff by inserting and releasing for each 1 meter by adjusting the focusing screw the correct reading is taken for every 10 meters readings are taken signage back side intermediate side fore side are noted for the calculation it is possible to take 8 to 12 readings on each side if unable to see the cross hair the tripod should be shifted to next location that shifting location is called change point next we can see how to do the calculations there are two methods to find the radius level one is height of instrument method another one is rise and fall method in this simple and easiest method is height of instrument method we can see how to do the calculation in this method every 10 meter signage is taken first reading is back side last reading is fore side other readings are intermediate sides we can take first radius level as 100 meter it is referred as benchmark height of instrument is calculated by the formula radius to level plus back side here first radius to level is 100 taken as benchmark plus back side is 0.76 then height of instrument is 100.76 other radius to levels are taken by the formula height of instrument minus intermediate side or fore side height of instrument is 100.76 minus intermediate side is 0.8 the radius level is 99.960 like that all the radius levels should be found at the change point radius level is height of instrument minus fore side at the change point the leveling stuff should not be changed before changing the tripod the last reading is fore side after changing the tripod at the same location is back side at the change point the height of instrument will be changed the height of instrument is reduced to level plus back side here radius level is 99.305 back side is 0.65 the 
and height of instrument is ninety nine point nine five five. Next radius level is height of instrument minus intermediate sides. Likewise, all the radius levels are found. At the change point, radius level is height of instrument minus four sight. Here, calculation is done for. Two change points. After this, we have to check our calculation is correct or wrong. For that, summation of back sight values minus summation of four sight values is equal to last reduced level minus first reduced level should be same. For sum of back sight, two back sight values are added. For sum of four sight, all the four sight values are added. Sum of back sight minus sum of four sight is calculated. That is minus one point six four. Then last radius level minus first radius level is calculated. Both the values are same, so our calculation is correct. The purpose of taking leveling on railway track is. to maintain the surface level based on the reduced level the how much sag is there which lift is given by the tamping machine in this calculation highest point is 960 plus uh, general lift given by the tamping machine is 30 mm then how much lift is required for each and every point is calculated based on this reduced level while calculating lift down gradient and up gradient also taking into the consideration the correct lifting value is given to the tamping machines that will be clarified in future videos thank you